Um, I brought this sign that I acquired um, from some friends of mine. It was originally pur purchased at a yard sale and um, they had it hanging in their back porchway. And I'm a general contractor and I commented about the sign because of its local origin. And next thing I knew, they gave it to me. So oh, wow. I was really pleased to um, acquire it. And um, I just think it's in great shape and probably over 100 years old. Um, and I would assume it's hand painted based on how old it is, do you know? I, I would think so, or yeah, um, maybe stenciled. Um, I think it was probably supplied by the paint company to Bowie's Hardware as, as one of their sales agents for that brand of paint, um, which I've never heard of. <laughs> yeah, me neither. The building was built after the 1880 fire, I understand. and. It was torn down in 1973, but it was a large building on Front Street, um, and they sold anything from nails to just a lot of hardware items. Okay, this is a Keystone Coin um, watch fob, and I think this jeweler, Harry Griffin, that says jeweler Milton PA, was probably a jeweler that was in town prior to the fire because I've never heard of his store. So pre-1880. Pre-1880. Um, it's nickel coin is what it's made out of. And it was probably just an advertising piece they gave to customers. Um, and it was a fob that actually went in your vest pocket and it, you could use it to open your pocket watch on the back if you had to wind it. Or um, I just thought it was a great little advertising piece from Milton's past and, and has the Pennsylvania Keystone at the top of it. And how did you acquire that? I purchased this at a, a flea market, a local flea market. Well, it's just a part of the past, you know, from over a hundred years ago, I think. And um, uh, they kind of connect certainly to Milton's history. You know, it's places that are long gone. Um, and I just enjoy the local history items. <laughs>